Hi, my name is Dr. Sarah Lejeune. I'm an equine surgeon at UC Davis at the School of Veterinary Medicine. I'm a boarded surgeon with a primary focus on emergency surgery, which of course encompasses primarily colic surgery. If you think your horse is having colic, so it's not eating, maybe it's pawing a little bit, it's rolling around, it's just not looking its usual self, you should call your veterinarian right away and make sure they come right away and check out your horse. Then, depending on what they say, really quick referral to a surgical facility is critical for success. So what we know is that the longer you wait to send the horse and to have advanced treatment, the harder it is for us to treat it and for the horse to have a positive outcome. The other thing you need to remember is that doesn't necessarily mean that your horse will automatically have surgery. In fact, most horses don't need surgery and will resolve their colic symptoms with medical management, which will include some anti-inflammatories, some, some uh, fluid therapy, etc. Now, if your horse does have colic surgery, the thing that's important to stress is that most horses will recover from the surgery, particularly if they don't have any dead intestine in their abdomen. And so, really, we report up to 95% success rate for survival of these horses. Additionally, you know, we're all interested in recovering a horse that will be useful to us, that we can go back to ride and enjoy for many years to come. And it is actually feasible to have that happen, where most horses will go back to their previous level of athletic activity.